In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can translate your 1688 app to English. I'm going to be showing you two methods on how you can translate the app and I'm also going to be showing you how you can translate it if you are using browser. And you can do this on your smartphone. So without further ado, let's jump right into the video. So to get started, we are going to download this first method. We are going to be downloading an app and the name of the app is going to be Tap Translator right so you go ahead and then this is the app right here so click here to install so once you are done with the installation you want to click on open all right so at this point it's going to show you all the different options so you want to come here and you are not going to subscribe to anything so once you get here you are going to see this interface so this first one you can leave it default this one as well you can leave it default so you want to come here then you want to change it to shinish shinish simplified so click on it then once you click on it you want to come here and click on this um this cycle this rest cycle so click on it now it's going to ask you to accept this permission so you want to click on accept so it's going to redirect you to this setting. So you want to look for the app. Yeah. So the name of the app is Tap Translator. So for me, I'm just going to show down a little bit. So this is the app right here. You can see that it said not allow. So you want to check mark it to allow it. So once that is done, you want to go back. Then you want to click on this again. Then it's going to show this. Just click on accept then click on start now all right so um you can remove it like this now you want to make sure that this thing is green right so this thing is green now you cannot go ahead and open your state eight app or any shinish app you have on your phone so right now this is my state eight app and now for me to translate any of this thing you can see this is the tab um translator right here so i'm just going to click on this just tap on it like this so you can see that it's rolling then once it's done rolling you're just going to translate this whole page for you all right so once you click on that it's going to show you a page like this you can see that all this thing has been translated you are going to see the translation on every of everything here so let's say you want to click on any of this thing maybe you want to translate the main page for example let's say you want to click on this product so if i click on it um click on it again so this is the product page so now let's say i want to translate this page the way it is now so all i have to do is to show down a little bit right and uh, click on this tab to translate any of the things i want to translate here even if i want to translate this review i can still use the same this uh um, this tab translator to translate this all i have to do is just to click on it and it's going to translate the page for me as i said earlier you can use it to translate anything i can still come back here and try to translate the name of this product and the other information i'm going to get so i'm just going to click on this same thing then translate that is the exactly how you can translate anything on this page once you get to the page just click on the tab just like the name just tap it then it's going to translate everything on the page for you that is how you can use this tab translator now the second method i'm going to be showing you in this video is to download google translator so this is the app right here this is the app right here so just click on open you in your own case you are going to be installed so you are you are going to install it then once you install it, this is the exact interface it's going to give you now what you want to do at this point is to go back to your 1688 app then take a screenshot right so take a screenshot once you take the screenshot you want to go back to the google translator app then you want to click on this camera so once you click on the camera you are going to see the screenshot you just screenshot you just click on it then select the screenshot so in my own case this is the screenshot now this is how this is what is going to show you so it's going to show you the translate of everything you are going to find on this page so when you you can even zoom it to get a proper look on anything that it translated this one is kind of more flexible compared to the first one because this one you can just zoom it to get the clearer picture of everything you are trying to get 
but that's not so you can just screenshot the page anytime you have something like this so it's going to translate everything to you just like this so let's say i want to translate another page so i'm just going to go back to the 68 app let's say i want to translate the um let's say this so then let me click on it again So let me show to the maybe the review you can see the review here so click on it let's say this time around you want to translate the review all right i want to translate the review so for me to translate this review now all i have to do is to take a screenshot then i'm going to go back to my um, google translate app then i'm going to select the image here now i can read this like this or i can just zoom it to have a proper look on the review i can show down to the next review then read it so basically this is how you can use this second app now let's say you are not using app and you are using the websites either on android or um, on iphone this is exactly how you can translate the page so i'm just going to go to m dot uh com. click on it so once you get here this is the main page so what you want to do is that you want to click on this three dots up here so click on it then if you show down a little bit you are going to find this translate just, just click on this translate then it's going to translate this entire page for you now you can go ahead and read anything you want to read there and you can even go ahead and click on any of these products to check out right so click on any of these products so once again once you get to this particular page to the product page you can still do the same thing click here then scroll down so you find this translate then translate the page then right now you can just go ahead and see everything that is going on on this page you can check the review uh, i don't want to use the app you can check the review read the review and all that so basically that is how you can translate the 1688 app on websites i hope you find this video helpful i hope you find this video valuable if you find this video helpful kindly give this video a thumbs up so that youtube can recommend this video to more people like you share this video with your friends subscribe to this channel turn on the bell notification so that anytime i drop a new video just like this you will be among the first people to be notified